The Canadian Cancer Society's Lodge in Victoria is a home away from home for people battling cancer and their caregivers. The Lodge offers a variety of services and amenities from wellness programs to emotional and psychological supports. Tess Van Stratton has more in this week's Vital People. Campbell River resident Quinton Dodd has been undergoing cancer treatment in Victoria for the last few weeks. I have cancer in the throat at the bottom of the tongue. They do, uh, if possible, six treatments over five days in, here in Victoria. But the rigorous treatment schedule has been made easier because Quinton's been able to stay at the Canadian Cancer Society's Vancouver Island Lodge across from the Royal Jubilee Hospital. Oh, it's been absolutely amazing. They are so solid in their support. They're endlessly kind and patient and understanding. The well-appointed 21-room lodge, which even has a wig room, is a home away from home for people going through cancer treatment. It's different than a hotel. When you come stay with us, um, all your meals are looked after. You meet other people that are going through the exact same um, treatments or at least going through cancer. And um, so you develop that bond and you have a huge support system. That support system also includes dedicated volunteers like Phil Blanchard, who had colon cancer eight years ago. I have to say that the six months of chemo was a bit of a challenge. <laughs> but uh, it, it followed a, a really good uh, uh, surgical solution to my cancer at the beginning, so I, w I was fortunate. Phil's been a volunteer driver for the last five years, shoveling people to appointments and helping out however he can. When I was going through treatment, uh, I found the volunteers uh, really made a big difference to the day. It does feel good, yeah. There's, there's a lot of satisfaction to knowing that you're contributing to somebody feeling better. The volunteers are absolutely unreal. They're always very positive, very polite, very kind, and very understanding. They go beyond, they really do. They go a thousand miles beyond. The lodge, which is often booked up several weeks or even months in advance, charges a subsidized nightly fee of just $52 which includes meals and snacks, thanks to the generosity of donors. It is such a rewarding job because you're helping and you're making a difference in people's lives that are going through such difficult times. And yeah, it's just heartwarming to be able to help in that way. As for Quinton, he's wrapping up his treatment and his prognosis is good. In a way, I'm gonna miss it because I've had such wonderful treatment by everybody here at the uh, lodge. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.